Hello YouTube and the Tribe of the Horror Realm. This is a, uh, I guess a video that's going to be pulling double duty. And uh, part of it is uh, an entry into our friend uh, Kofi's contest where he's asking me if you have a favorite film that you've double dipped on that you might have multiple copies on. And this also acts as my biannual, which I usually do June, July, and of course in October, update on the uh, stuff that I've gotten in from my Halloween collection. Um, so I actually don't really, I only do them twice a year, I might even start doing them once a year because I hate being redundant since I already had a video from last year of what I had. But there's probably stuff that I've gotten since then that people may not have seen. So I'm going to run through them real quick because I don't want to take up too much, too much time. Um, Alright, so anyhow, right off the bat, um, this is the Ghetto Blockbuster Halloween Trilogy Collection, all extended play copies. Um, this actually has Halloween 1, 2, and 3, and it is in... This is the copy that is also in it. This is just an individual sealed copy of the Blockbuster version. Um, big media version in the rental box of Halloween. Um, I'm actually trying to... I have VPD. This is actually should have been with the UK stuff because this is a PAL tape. So, we'll throw it over there. Uh, copies of Halloween. Um, from the second media release. Um, this particular one is a 1981 tape in there. Um, the boxes are pretty much going to be the same, but the tapes are different. They're um, dated differently. This is a 1981 release. This is 1985 uh, release. And this one, I have no idea what it is because it's a sealed copy. Got the media stickers on them. This is the one Teresa threw in the uh, laundry. So it shrank. Ha ha ha. No. Beta tape of Halloween. Uh, restored collector's edition. This is the full frame version. And then we have full frame but with the lenticular cover. And this is the widescreen restored version. So obviously aside from the difference in here you can see that they use different colors for the logo but everything else is a little bit well, there you go. You can see everything else is the same but the backs are obviously different. Oh. Anniversary edition of Halloween which um, in a clamshell case. Which I can't get open. There we go. This was also available in a collector set with a um, bloody snow globe. Awesome packaging. Halloween, the uh, extended edition on VHS. And this is a sealed copy of the limited edition uh, two tape set, which I'm sure you, everyone has seen already. It's pretty much the really cool orange tapes. And yeah, it's great. Yeah, everyone's seen it. It's got the two tapes, got a little keychain. Um, little tchotchke stuff here and there. Uh, moving along on VHS. This is an Italian copy, of VHS copy of Halloween. Nothing too fancy. 
it's still pretty cool. Good size box too, compared to uh, you know the standard U.S. ones. Um, I know I've shown this one before, which because it was kind of uh, cool packaging and it had this that really odd picture of um, Michael Myers from um, Kim Gottlieb Walker. Um, this is a Japanese media release, um, more like a rental type thing where you, you could rent the tape and still leave the package behind so people knew if it was there or not or that you actually did carry it. Oh, back again, the UK media. Um, another big... Love this one. This is a pre-cert UK media tape. And I got that from a, a seller and then had it actually sent to Kofi so he could send it to me. Because we were sent, you know, trading off some stuff. Um, gold bordered four color, vi or, yeah, four front video from UK. Um, I know uh, Gaz has told me about these, that they did a lot of horror ones with, with the same border, so it looks pretty cool when they're all together. This is the Halloween one. Special edition of Halloween and Halloween 2 on one tape, which I guess would kind of suck when you had, if you wanted to just watch Halloween 2 and you'd have to fast forward through it. Um, I got two copies. Halloween, like, also UK. Pretty cool looking cover. So that's VHS. Now I'm going up here real quick. Um, this is actually not the most recent Halloween copy that's come out. Um, this is the one with the lint, this O-ring with the uh, holographic cover there. Um, but this actually has the old Anchor Bay logo. The, there is editions that have the new one, just haven't got around to picking it up yet. Same thing, but this time in the Anchor Bay uh, Horror Collections O-Ring. There should be another one. Here's the Horror Legacy one with... The Outstanding 2-Disc Anniversary Edition. 25th Anniversary Edition. Great, great edition. Really like watching it in that one. Um, the 25 Years of Terror 2-Disc set. Um, everyone knows what that is. The 30th anniversary set, which of course included not only the movie, but the Blu-ray, the extended cut, Halloween, um, 25 Years of Terror is also in this, as well as Halloween 4 and 5. Then these are the limited edition ones. that are, They were all numbered... Um, with a lenticular cover, came with the regular version of the film as well as the extended TV cut. And uh, the reason I have four of them is that um, they actually have um, postcards that you could get. There was four postcards that were different ones. There was one of um, Carpenter with uh, John Michael Graham and P.J. Souls, um, one of Jamie Lee Curtis one of Donald Pleasance and Nancy Stevens, and then one of Mick Castle, uh, behind-the-scenes type stuff. So that's actually the four. That's why I have four of them. Um, kind of a, a tough thing to find, and when it's out there, it's pretty expensive. This is the extended cut with the original film cell. That one's still in package. And then the sealed copy of the extended cut of the film without the film sound. Um, just the mask version that they had come out. Um, then they also did a lenticular version. That's a sealed copy right there. This is my loose copy. And this is with the white logo, this is the very first edition of Halloween um, that came out on DVD. Obviously no art on the disc. Uh, 
um, from uh, Andrew Balliner. He got me um, this copy of the Australian release of Halloween. Then we move a little over to Europe and to France. The Halloween 30th anniversary edition has the 25th anniversary as well as the regular cop movie itself. So it's a three DVD set. I have no idea what that means, but another French copy of Halloween. And this one here, which has Halloween and Halloween 2, um, also French, could very well be a bootleg. If not, they just didn't put much of an effort into it. Uh, Germany, marketing films, copy of Halloween, A Cut Above the Rest, which is documentary. Hard box red edition of Halloween. Another German edition of Halloween from Carol Media. Uh, at the moment, the prize of my collection, German hard box that's sealed, um, limited to 111 copies. This is number 12. Um, German perfect uh, edition collection, which comes a little flashing strobe button, which I'm sure the batteries have probably died off right now. And then the Perfect Collection DVD, which I'm sure I've gone through this before. I won't get into it now because I'm already at 12 minutes on this thing. And there's people like, oh my god, I've seen this video done before. Um, Reese, I don't know if this is a promotional thing, or this is just how they actually send their stuff out a lot of times, but a little uh, Greek version of the uh, DVD. Now, as you can see, that's the artwork on it there, so it's the same, similar to the cover here. There's also this double disc with Alfred Hitchcock's Spellbound and Halloween that's also from Greece. It's a two-disc set. And it comes with that set D DVD as well. Um, now to England. Three versions of the mask and pumpkin. Um, we got this one, which for the life of me, I don't understand why it's actually like superimposed over Michael's face. That's the bad art decision. Same one, but as you can see at the, well, not only the, they changed the logos here, but we've got the um, horror classics. A little different on the back. And then this one here, You've got the lenticular going from Michael's mask to that. Who knows? 25th anniversary editions from the UK. So we've got, um, this is actually two of the same ones I've got. I managed to have two of them. Uh, differences, obviously, you can see from... These look very similar. This one has got the Divi Max edition here. Um, this was, I guess, a promotional piece for this Strongbow, which this one is not. Um, no, this here. And this one happens to be... Not for sale, promotional use only. And those lack it as well. So there's differences to them. As far as what's 
in, inside well. There you go. 25th anniversary editions and then two. Halloween, the inside story, um, the bio um, documentary that only was available to the UK. Then the Halloween, um, 25 Years of Terror. Um, and this one is the four disc version of the film, of the 25 Years of Terror. I have to work on getting a copy of the uh, two to twenty-five years from the UK. All right. Um, also, promotional stuff. This was um, from the Star Irish Daily Star. So a little I um, insert DVD of Halloween, and then from the Sun in the UK. We got that one there. Um, US UMD. Really need to track down a UK one, but I'll tell you, pain in the ass to find one in, with the cover. You'll, you can find them, you know, just the UMD, but apparently these things get tossed out all the time. You kids. Uh, Blu-rays. Uh, U.S. copy of Halloween. Australian. I'm running out of time. Battery's about to die. French. German. Media book, German media book from um, Mr. Snickers 21, UK one, and Criterion, US Criterion, and uh, image uh, uh, laser discs. That's it. My battery's going to die. Ran over. So that's the uh, collection as it stands. Comments, thanks for watching, and uh, happy Halloween.